Okay, this is a demo of the uh, new histogram package. Uh, if we want to take a look at how we can actually use this system, uh, we uh, start by looking at some of the API elements that are available to us. So here's a little API, uh, the histogram stat. What we'll do here is we'll just um, comment it out and we'll make a new instance of the histogram stat. Uh, first of all, we'll start with the uh, the title. Actually, what we can do here, oh, very good. Let's uh, borrow these parameters, paste them into here. String for title will be um, equal to, uh, oh, I know how to do this. Histogram stat. HS equals new histogram stat. We put in a title, uh, an X label, a uh, number of bins, let's say 25 bins. The low will be um, minus one, the high will be one. Okay. Then what we'll do is we'll look at what we can do with a histogram stat and add numbers. So let's make some numbers up. Let's do um, a for loop for integer. Uh, let's see now. Uh, i equals zero. While i is less than a uh, hundred. I plus plus. And then what we'll do is. Um, We'll say uh, hs dot add uh, the sine math dot sine of i, and then what we'll do is we'll uh, look at get stats, get min, get max. What can we do here? Well, we've got an X label, we've got a Y label, we've got a whole bunch of stuff. But we're done. So now all I need to do is plot it. I would think that would be easy, right? Well, here's a demo panel. Now, the demo panel probably, yeah, it's got its graphics, got everything in here. Demo panel looks like something you can just create. Let's see if we can go back to our main and make a demo panel. Demo panel dp equals new demo panel. Oh, very nice. dp dot. Uh, is there any setters? Set. Huh. Well, let's see who uses this demo panel. Nobody. Well, the demo panel looks like it's got no possibility for reuse. It's very specific. I wonder why anyone would do this. Mm, perhaps just as an example of how to do some plotting of a histogram. That extends the plot panel. Okay, what's the plot panel do for me? Ah, plot panel. Let's see who uses the plot panel. Oh, here's something called the hist panel. Excellent. That's what you're looking for. So we'll make a, a thing called the hist panel. Very good. So we'll go back to our main. We'll make a hist panel. And hist panel needs something. It needs a histogram. Excellent. So now I got my histogram, I got my hist panel, let's see who uses the hist panel, looks like the hist panel is used here, 
Uh, do we need anything with this? That's got some buttons, got some other junk. Really don't need it. So what we'll do is we'll make a frame. Closable uh, J frame equals new closable J frame. And then what we'll do is we'll say um, CF dot get content plane. Perhaps we can just do an add. And we'll add the uh, histogram panel. Oh, we got to get the content pane and then do the add. Get content pane and do the add. Why are you giving me a hard time on this? Okay. Container C. Oh, I think I can do an add component. Let's try that. Okay. Add component. There you go. Now you're there. And I better set the frame size. And we'll make it 200 by 200. And then we'll uh, set the visibility to be true. And let's see what that buys me. Ooh, how very nice. Ain't that nice? That's very nice. I'm liking this. Very cool. What if you had a thousand and did it again? Very cool. Very cool. Now, what if you had, um, I divided by a thousand point zero, then it would range from zero to a thousand, which would allow it to go from uh, zero. To I goes from zero to a thousand, so um, I over a thousand is going from zero to one. Then you multiply it by two times pi, two times math dot pi, times i. So now you got a number that goes from 0 to 1 very smoothly. Very cool. Very cool. Now suppose you went out and you got the, um, the wave test. Right? Wave test says I can get the double data on the wave and then play it. Let's have a look and see how that works. reasonably well. So now what we'll do is we'll go out and get the wave data, put it into the uh, main and then uh, we'll get the double data and for loop for integer whoops integer i equals zero while well, i is less than d dot length i plus plus and then we'll say uh, hp dot add no oh, histogram histogram stats dot add uh, let me see what do we got here uh, d of i and I believe we're good. Isn't that good? That's good. Let's try it. Oops. Running the wrong thing. Let's run. Is there a play in here? There's no play. So let's just run it. There it is. The numbers are ranging from 0 to 3.5. Zero to pi, practically. Very cool. And that is how you use the histogram.